look at this. Holy crap, guys. They have an entire plethora of zombie babies and cats. I just found 10 cents on the ground. I'm gonna put that towards something nice and new. All right guys, today we are in Lancaster, Ohio. It might even be pronounced Lancaster. We are at this spirit Halloween back here that used to be an elder Beerman. I remember I filmed this exact location a couple years ago because I remember right across the street here, if you look very close, there is a Frisch's Big Boy and there's actually a Big Boy statue out there that I took a picture with. All right, let's go in and see what kind of awesomeness we can find in the Spirit Halloween in Lancaster, Ohio. Thank you. Very strange. I thought I heard someone yelling for me as I was entering the store. Wowzer, this is a big store, guys. And I love how even though it appears they don't have any animatronics left that are actually set up, they've taken the initiative and put up all these inflatables in their place. How cool is that? I'll tell you what, it is definitely funny to have experienced the entire season of Spirit Halloween from seeing these things be put together to seeing them being torn down. No matter what, we love it all the same. So let's go ahead and take a look at what they do have set up over here. And oh my gosh, they have a ton of these inflatables. So let's check it out. We have a ghost face inflatable here. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No, we, <laughs> we have like six. Oh my gosh, I'm counting wrong. We have three ghosts. We have two tombstones. We have three jack-o'-lanterns. We have a fright in the box here. We have a jack-o'-lantern archway over here. We have two of the big ghosts. These are the ones that I believe are eight feet tall if I'm not mistaken. We do have a jumping spider that is frozen in time. We have two more jack-o'-lantern archways over here, right below the creepy crimson girl on a swing. We have another Fright in the Box over here. Ooh, he's on sale for 75 bucks. We got two scarecrow archways. We have haunted trees, a reaper down here, which I bought the other day, another giant ghost, and we have a secret keeping cat. If he were bigger, I would buy him, but he's only like three feet tall or something, so I think I'm going to pass. We have another Fright in the Box here and another Scary Clown Archway. Actually, I think this is the first Scary Clown Archway we've seen in this whole area. Oh, look at this. We have Monty's Abandoned Home. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'll tell you what, guys. It is heartbreaking to see the season coming to an end. Okay, let's take a walk around here and see what else we can find. Oh boy, very heartbreaking to see the empty bubble tubes of death. Oh my gosh, how crazy is this? Okay, so look at this. These are actually plastic, I think. I thought they were glass, but I believe they're plastic. All right, let's just take a little walk around the store here, guys. I did notice a stack of jumping spiders over here, but let's keep on moving here and see what else we have. How are you doing? Good, how are you? Okay, let's keep on moving, guys. See what we can find throughout this awesome, awesome store. Oh my gosh, I'm just gonna cry when it's all over. Look at this, guys. They actually have one of the biggest selections left of ghost face stuff that I've seen in any store recently. This stuff has been sold out everywhere. Now, granted, this is the kids section, but they still have like the knives, a couple of different kind of knives, the bleeding knife over here, and they have the buck knife over here, which I actually just bought in the other store. And they have a good handful of costumes left if your kid wants to be a bleeding ghost face or a light up ghost face or even the glow in the dark ghost face. All right, let's round this corner here. I wonder if we will find any zombie babies or secret keeping cats or creeping cats. We'll just have to look through all the aisles. All right, maybe back here. I don't see any secret keeping cats yet. 
but I do see zombie babies. Yes, look at this. Holy crap, guys. They have an entire plethora of zombie babies and cats. Beginning on the top, we have four creeping cats. Underneath them, we have two secret keeping cats. Oh my gosh, even though I already own him, I want to buy both of them. Then we have a whole bunch of zombie babies. Look at this. We have Ravenous Ruby. We have Spider Biter Billy. We actually have one, two, three, four, five Spider Biter Billies. And can you believe it? We found a store that at the end of the season has two Burrito Babies. And look at this, this is funny. I've pointed this out before. This tag says Swaddled Simon. I wanna know if any of you have a Burrito Baby where the tag says Swaddled Silas. You know what? I'm gonna adopt these two right now. Okay, I just put them up at the counter. I'm taking them home today. Let's reposition the burrito babies to the upper shelf since we just cleaned it off. Guys, why is it that even though I already own some of this stuff, like the secret keeping cats, what are you looking at? That I just wanna buy more? I bet he could tell us, but he won't. Okay, let's come on over here. Yeah, they already told me that they are completely sold out of all their animatronics, guys. What a bummer. I mean, it's great for the company. I'm glad they're all sold out. But it's so heartbreaking to come in here and see everything empty because we know it's the end of the season. At least we still have one blue bubble tube of death. And if you listen closely, you can hear the electricity of death. All right, let's come over here and go on through. I think the floor is already buzzing. I hear it, let's see. It is, the floor is buzzing. And look at this, we have three of the four elect, all four of them are working. All four of the electricities of death. Okay, now we're down to one. Please murder me one more time. Ah. <laughs> come on. Please murder me one more time. Ah! Okay, now that we've been murdered one last time, let's come on out here and take a look at the masks. Do they have any Michael Myers, any Freddy, any Ghost Face, or any Leather Face? And I do not see any of them. Those were hot sellers this season, guys. We do have the wall of bad breath over here. I should just bring some double mint gum with me and pass it out to these guys. I don't have gum, but I do have stickers. Okay, let's come on over here and just see if they have the ghost face section in the adult section. It's probably over here by where Monty was, if they do. Wow, they do have an entire stack of the Ghostface Spirit shirts here. That's kind of surprising. And let's see here. Surprisingly, they do have a whole bunch of Nightmare on Elm Street stuff still. That's been pretty sold out in other stores too, as well as Chucky. I don't know, Chucky is usually pretty stocked. And look at this, we do have a couple of Ghostface things here. Not very many, but we have the Dead by Daylight Viper Face. We have a regular ghost face mask and one chrome ghost face mask. I'm really surprised that one is here. And they have one adult size ghost face costume up here. It has a light up ghost face mask. They do have plenty of Jason stuff still in stock as well as Sam from Trick or Treat. But like all the other stores right now, guys, if you did not get a Michael Myers mask early, you are probably out of luck. They are even still totally stocked with killer clowns from outer space, including the acid pie, two side steppers, and the hand puppets. Look at this, they have one, two, three, four of the hand puppets. And they still have a ton of Beetlejuice stuff here if you wanna be any different version of Beetlejuice or Lydia, or you can just get the Beetlejuice mask, or you can be Barbara, you can be Adam with his finger eyes. 
Ooh, and they even have the wacky mole costume. They got the crouchy costume. And look up here, guys. They have the hugs costume. I hope so much that they bring Hugs the animatronic back very soon, like, you know, next year. I'm still on the hunt for the shrunken head. Let's see if they would happen to have it anywhere around here. What the heck? I know now that the shrunken heads have been in some stores this year because people sent me pictures of it. What a tease. We may not have that, but we do have two Skelly Bones plush. And to top it off, guys, look at this. Look at all the side steppers they have. We got Lydia, we got Sam, we got the Frankenstein, which is the first one I bought this year. And we have Billy Butcherson. I thought I saw another one somewhere, but maybe not. But they do have three of these awesome Michael Myers carving the pumpkins. Those are sweet. And I can't believe that I haven't bought one of these this season. Lots of hanging Sams and Sam greeters and Sam groundbreakers. And this is the mug I was talking about before. Somebody showed online where if you look at it in the light, you can see that it has a strange texture. But in reality, when you fill it up with a hot drink, there's actually something else that appears on there. It's pretty dang cool. Oh, we can't forget the whole plethora of bouncy heads here. We have Gizmo, we have Zero, we have Jack Skellington, and Sam. All right, guys, that was an awesome store. I adopted my zombie babies, and I am ready to roll out to the next one. Mm -hmm.